Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to use a firewall on Windows as well as Linux. So let's get started. Two months back, I was deploying a Linux VPS and just after an hour, hackers from China started brute forcing SSH on my server. There were 147 failed attempts in just one hour. So to protect my server, first I disabled root access and then enabled rules to my firewall to block that particular sequence of IP. After that attempt, brute force were reduced. This is how firewall helps you protect your system. Firewall can be of two types, hardware and software. In hardware firewall, a protection device is placed between the device and the internet. This type of firewall is used for protecting servers. Software firewall is a program that resides on your machine and blocks traffic according to the rules you set. In this video, we'll be exploring software firewall. Let's start with Windows firewall. To open the firewall, go to control panel. Select view by large icon. Select Windows Defender firewall. Then select advanced setting from left sidebar. Now on the left panel, you will see inbound and outbound rules. Inbound rules are rules for traffic that comes from the web to your machine and outbound rules are the rules for traffic that goes from your machine to the web. Now suppose I have a game or a software and I am not sure if it's safe. It can send my data to a remote server using some background process after execution. I can turn off the internet while using the software but other services that require internet may cause some issues. In this situation we can use firewall to block a single program accessing the internet. First let's start with the inbound rule. Click on inbound rule, then click on new. In the next step, you can select a program or a port to block. Suppose a program uses a random port 444 to send a data to a server, you can block that particular port. For this example, you will select program. On the next screen, we need to select the exe file to block. Click on browse and select the file. On the next screen, we need to select whether we want to block or allow internet access to selected application. For this example, I will select block. On the next screen, we need to select where should the rule apply. If you don't know what this means, then you probably don't need it. Click next. Here enter a name to identify the rule and click finish. You need to do the same for outbound rule. And now if you execute the application that you added to firewall, you'll see that the application doesn't have the access to internet. This was the method for Windows firewall. Now we'll show you how to configure rules for Linux IP table firewall. For this example, I'll be using Kali Linux in virtual machine. To install IP table, run the following command. sudo apt get install IP table. After this IP table will be installed. To see the list of rules, run the following command iptable-l Currently there are no rules So we are going to set two different rules First to block my host machine from sending packets to my virtual machine and second to block access from my VM to external server or website IP of my main machine is 192.168.0.222 and IP of my virtual machine is 192.168.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.